Not even in theory, because this is what we call it a negated attribute about God. These things negated. You cannot, you cannot describe a tree as monkey. You can't. You understand? I do not want to be part of the kingdom of God. Because yeah. after the first so according, million years, so according, you will get bored. We know heaven is not perfect. Otherwise, the devil now, would have never rebelled no, no, against no, no, the Almighty. No, no. Now, by the way, how would you feel no, no, no. after a few billion no, no. years of? Constantly worshipping the read, same read figure. This one. Our Everybody point. Bore it. Read this one. Read okay. This. Read it to okay. Okay. Loudly, loudly. New international version. I will only yeah. re read, read the King read, James read, version because okay, that is poetry. Read, the read, other read, forms of the read, Bible read, are, read, are, read, are read, awful. Okay. Read, King read, James read, version. Read, 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 and I will kill. Read, what do you? What do you want me to read? read Revelation. Okay. Yeah, I will. I will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a King James version. Okay. I will kill her children with death. I will. And all the churches, churches shall know that I am he who searches the minds and hearts. I will give to each one of you according to your words. This is a loving Jesus. He will kill children. Like he did in the Old Testament, he will do in the New Testament. I, I don't know if you're aware of my position, but I don't, I, I, the uh, prospect of ascending to an almighty kingdom of eternity thank you. Oh, no, thank you, thank not you. only terrifies me, but repulses me. It is repugnant to the human nature. Who here would honestly want to exist in an eternal state of being? Even if you were constantly in a state okay. of bliss and happiness, no. it would become boring and dull after the first million, billion, hundred billion years. People, okay. listen to your heart. Would you exist in this state of being? I think not. And thus I refuse it. Yeah, I prefer Allah the khair. maggots to embrace me. All right. Yes. Now, now I, I look forward to embracing them. To embrace who? The maggots. Let them feast upon my rotting corpse when I die. Okay. And I can embrace oblivion. All right. My, my question, my question yeah. is to you. So you. You are an atheist, yes? That's, Indeed, yes. Okay, all right. What made you to come to, come to this conclusion? Because I thought that there were so many contradictions within the very idea of God. God is all-knowing. If he is all-knowing, how does he know ignorance? How does he know what the feeling of what it is like not to know? If he is all-loving, he all why is he made us suffer? If he is all-powerful, can he reduce his own power? So these inherent contradictions and difficulties Good. within the very notion of the divine has led me to the path of atheism. Can I answer you? Mm -hmm. Now, according to Islam, we say God do things that befits his majesty and glory. Meaning, there are th certain things which doesn't befit his majesty, doesn't befit him as God, as divine. Yeah. So these things, which is, it doesn't befit him, those are what you call it negated things about God. Like, for example, to say God to become ignorant. Yeah, as you mentioned here, when God is all-knowing, God to become ignorant, this doesn't befit his majesty. So that's why he cannot be described as ignorant. And as well, he cannot be an ignorant, not because he's unable or about ability. It's about these are what you call it negated attributes about the divine, which is like, that's why when, for example, one of the things, which is one of the How common... How could he know what it is like to know everything? No, he knows. He doesn't know the experience of no, not, He doesn't need to have experience to know things. You understand? So that's I why you understand. understand. I don't now, understand. Now, for example, when we, when we create, for example, the computers and all of these things, for example, not necessarily we have to live on electricity in order for us to understand what's going on there. But we do understand when we created them, we know the details of them. Even us as a creation to something that we create but and I we craft. I don't know the details. Yes. Yes. I, I'm ignorant when it comes so to... So that's technology. why, with ignorance, that's why what we say to you, God do things that befits his majesty and glory. Simple as that. You, you are defending an idea which is inherently contradictory. <laughs> I, 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 you are defending... I'm sorry. I, look, you, I, you seem like a reasonable chap. But you, you are defending, you understand, you are, yes. you are actually defending a, a, an idea, an idea which we cannot see. Okay. We, we cannot see. This is our so, suit. And, and if you cannot see, uh, 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 if you cannot see something, you have to, you have to judge the idea. You have to judge the idea um, on the grounds of whether it is coherent or not coherent. 
the idea of God, the idea of Allah, is actually logically incoherent. It's, it's, not, it's not an idea, by the way. It's not an object. idea. You can by the way, it's not an idea. That's, you take it as an idea, but we I do take it yes. as an idea. The issue is you have to understand the concept behind it. I think first, it of, first of all, you, that's what, what you are thinking. You are taking it as an idea. Us, we don't take it. We say our, our existence actually relies on the existence of God, basically that he has created us. And yep. that's why otherwise we cannot, we cannot be existed. As simple as that. And as well, this universe has a starting point. Since it has a starting point, who has initiated this starting point? This goes back to the root of it's, this. But I'm not talking about the contingency argument. I'm talking about the Let alone the contingencies. Because, God. because God, what happens if you it's are... Idea in let, let, me, let me tell you something. Mind. That idea may be real. You know, the issue is... Unreal, before you I'm discuss... it's actually logically yeah. incoherent. Before you discuss the you detail... Defend it. Before you discuss the detail, mm -hmm. discuss the root of it. Because what happens, we keep discussing now the detail. I'm talking about the root of the thing. Like, for example, when these people, Christian, they were discussing details. And I'm, say, I'm saying, why we discuss the details? Let's go back to the root well, of the I'm matter. I'm discussing the about... details because I don't understand what God was doing before the universe. Nor do you. But I'm uh, talking about the idea of God as we know it today. Yeah, the, the, the idea and of God, idea again... that idea is actually incoherent. It's not an, I, again, it's if not... If you really focus your powers of mental concentration and reason onto this idea of God, you will find that it's, it's nonsense, it's logically incoherent. That's why my point I'm is sorry, before, I, before, I don't want before, to listen, your religion, listen before you go, before you do okay, this, yes. before you go to this, if you are discussing about if it's a coherence or incoherence, before you discuss, discuss the root of the matter. Yes. This universe exists. Yes, you exist. This I universe do, exists. I exist. All yes. right, good. This universe has a starting point. Do you agree with this? Of course, yeah. So if it has, how, how did it start? Uh, th th I, this is not my. If, this is not at all what I'm guessing at. I'm saying the idea of God is incoherent. The, you see here before You're asking me a again, again. With, my with point is to you. For example, again, before we discuss the details, let's discuss the root of the thing. We can, uh, we can discuss the root. But I must ask. No, let's I, discuss. I, I, let's I, discuss the root. God listen, listen. Moment, after, after we do this, powerful. Can he reduce his own power? How can be all knowing if he can if he does not know the experience? Okay, good. Of ignorance. Going back or to the pain point. Or suffering. Okay. Or does see? And uh, which listen, case if he does. You know, repeated this yeah, a few yeah, times. Yeah, yeah, I and, and, and my I point is, like before that. before we discuss this, yes. let's go to the root of the matter. Then we'll then we'll come to this point. Okay. So that's uh, the root of the matter of the existence of God. And then after we demonstrate about if God exists or not, then after that we'll discuss these details. Okay. What you are, you are no, discussing you're, details. You're using this as a strategy to No, 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 no. I will question. not, listen, listen. I will answer I'm your question. You listen, yes. listen. We will answer this question yeah. after demonstrating the root of the matter. But the root why? of the matter, yeah, that, because everything why relies on something. Like thing, for example, no, it's, this is how it should be. Before you learn advanced math, mathematics, for example, you have to understand the basics. What is the root of their math before anything else? I'm so, going back, if, if this yeah. universe existed, yes. and which exists, which you agree okay. with this, so it has a starting point. Okay, well, uh, this to me leads say to that argument. Wow. No, no, why, why, did, why, did, why don't you? No, no, why, let's no, discuss it. Let's discuss it. So let's discuss okay, it. Then, then we'll discuss then that. Finally, we can actually talk about the incoherence. E exactly, of the exactly. Idea of yes, God. that's fine. Okay, we'll do if that. If you want to talk about the origins of the universe, yes. you do not know, I do not know what happened before the universe. Good, good. Because what is the universe? It is space and time. And it, you need space for something to have a cause and effect. Good. And you need time for that process to occur. Her. Good. So the universe is space and time. Outside of that, we cannot fathom good. that reality. So All right. Good. Good. There good. There needs to be a starting point or an end point. There's no time. How can you even talk about good. in those terms? So since no, so now here and again and again, yeah. you see here. That's why since it has a starting point, as you mentioned in, in time and space, that means there is an initiator for it. Not necessarily. Okay, then how did it come into existence? You're, you're, you're ultimately thinking within the scaffolding of your own mind. No, 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 no. With, this with your mind, let's use your judgment. No, no. Before outside, these laws break down. No, my before, friend. before we, we go know. outside. That's why, know. since we are talking inside this universe yes. and inside the space of the universe, yes. things happen for a reason. Yeah. So it but has a cause law, and it yeah, has cause. law does not apply outside no. of the universe. Yeah, that's my point. My point is, we, in this universe, yes. before you go to the beyond this universe, yes. in this universe, and in the space of this universe, things happen by, by cause and effect. That means the universe has a cause for it to start. 
Yeah. You understand? Of course. Yeah. So since it has a cause, this cause has to have certain characteristics. But, but you see, what you you're, understand? You're, you're, what you're doing is you're taking a law which exists within this universe, and then you're extracting that law and taking it outside the universe. And we have no idea whether the laws of this universe apply to the reality outside of it. No, not so necessarily. As a not necessarily. Fact, not that we're talking you about. We need to posit a god as no, Aristotle no, 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 did, no, no. as Aristotle did, yes. as an unmoved mover. Yeah. But regardless of this argument, yes, I exactly. want to get to the definition now. of God, which is incoherent. Yes, that's why. He's an incoherent what, what, being, what, my One second. This now, is why I'm an atheist. I think it's absurd. That's I'm sorry. Why, that's I why. Do. I, it's okay. Don't be sorry. That's well, uh, it's you'll be position. sorry later on. Not now. I'm sorry. I just didn't want to. <laughs> what, no, I, I, well, when I'm in oh, Jahannam, I'm with the best people. Yeah. My exactly. point is to you. Going back to the point, by the way. Uh, yeah. If you are here to listen to yourself, we well, are not interested. No, I am interested. Okay, interested. good. So my point is, this universe, since you said space and time, as you mentioned, that space and time. It has what is called the unmoved mover, the things that has initiated it. Yeah. This thing that has initiated it, it should have certain characteristics. It should have power. It should it should be powerful to, to create the, this universe. It should have knowledge to, to create this universe. And it should have a will to decide to create it or not. This is the, 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 the definition of God. That's what we, are, what, we, what we Muslims believe. Now, the point is, what you are saying, when, when we see something, when we say God is all powerful, Meaning there is no any point that he will lose his power. Yeah, you understand. So that's that's what we that's what we okay, believe in. So there's no point. There is no point he will lose his power. So in theory, could he reduce his knowledge at all to feel ignorant? No, no, no. not not in theory, not even in theory, because this is what we call it a negated attribute about God. These things negated. It, it, you cannot des you cannot describe a tree as monkey. You can't. You understand. So, so if you know everything then how can you know what it is like to be ignorant? So he, the, the thing is here, without experience, you don't need to have experience to know something. When you are the creator of something and has the absolute knowledge of everything, will, un will know and understand everything that's happening. But if you understand that, you can never not know. No, you know, definitely, you know. But that's, why, that's the point when we say all knowing means has, he's the possessor of all knowledge, includes everything that we are aware and things that we are not aware of so, as well. Say I, say I presented you with a, uh, a, 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 phys, a, a physics exam and there, there would be questions on there yeah. that you would not know. And mm. you would look upon those questions and you would feel the sensation of ignorance. Yeah. You would feel the sensation of not knowing something. Good. God can never know what that feels did, did like. You, uh, and therefore, he can never know everything. Good. That's Let's, what I'm asking okay. you. What, what's that? By the way, by the way, by the way, you see here, you exactly, you failed into the same, the same mistake that you were accusing us with. You are saying you are using your own analogy within this universe and decide things beyond this universe. So it's exactly the same thing we say to you. You are using your own idea, your own analogy and decide on behalf of God. You understand? That's no, what you are I, using. I, I because yeah, yes, you, you do this. Now here you're saying if someone doesn't have, doesn't know the feeling of being ignorant, yeah, yeah, yeah. meaning is doesn't know. No, that's not true. Because if someone knows, if the creator knows what is ignorance and knows what is knowledge, and he is the creator of everything and he is, he knows everything he will know everything you understand yeah so which means he is the possessor of all knowledge so we will not we are not using our own analogy and our own reasoning to to this to decide how god will will know about these things you understand i i i'm afraid because, i, I do because, not understand because that's beyond no. again this universe is exactly i will use the same but, argument to you Things you cannot use your own analogy within this universe to decide things beyond this universe. So, so, oh, it's exactly right. the same so concept. You're saying that we can ultimately not fathom the essence of God. We cannot understand. We God. cannot understand God. Com we cannot comprehend God totally. We know things about Him. For example, we know He is all powerful. We know that he is all-knowing. We know that he has independent will. We know that he has created everything. I'm sorry, we know that he owns everything. My that, question. Yeah, that's you, it. You, you, you see here. That's why our question. our knowledge about God yeah. is as limited as he has revealed what, to us. What, what we have done, we've constructed this idea of God by extracting things we have as humans. We know things, so we imagine what would it be like to know everything. We have 
how or what would it be? You're like imagining to again. You see, you're using Are your imagination. Can, you can, you can, can you imagine? Can you imagine beyond this universe? But when you actually consider, can you imagine beyond this universe? When you think of a being which possesses all power, omniscience, okay. omnipotence, omnipresence. Yes. You, you we don't say omnipresent, we don't say everywhere. Okay, he's we don't not say everywhere. everywhere. So no. Allah is not everywhere. Not everywhere. But no. how can he be all powerful if he's not everywhere all of no, It doesn't mean to be, you don't need to be everywhere to be all powerful. You need to be aware of everything. He's aware of powerful. everything. You don't need to be so everywhere. In his to knowledge, he is everywhere. He, in, in, a, his in his, yes, in his knowledge, is, uh, he knows everywhere. In his power, he is in everywhere in terms of power, but he is not everywhere in as in his essence. Doesn't it say that he is the size of a mountain? No, no. no. So, but he has defined borders. Then he is defined. There is no border borders. So, so he's immaterial. Mean no border means me, yeah. But we, no we don't we don't border. we don't say we don't say that no we don't say that the border that we think that he is there is nothing surrounds him. Yeah, that's true, which he says this. But as well, of course, this universe... This is another contradiction. Which is? That, that, that you cannot have something which is non-physical. Because if something not, is non-physical, it's that's, again, everywhere. You see here, everywhere. the problem is... All things need a physical uh, de definition. Yeah. Like this. Like, if I said this is non-physical, it's here everywhere, good, good. nowhere. So it's a contradiction is, That's term. why, because again, you are using this universe to decide about things that no, has to be physical. You, you, you are saying that God gave me my reason as a gift. It was a divine gift. I made in yes, God's yes. image. No, no, no. We reason. don't say we don't okay. say you made in okay, God's uh, as, as as you think. Through, so if my reason is from God, it must be pure and true. No, not necessarily. I, oh, not so, necessarily. So God gave me a faulty tool. He gave me a weak tool. No. He did, he didn't give you he give you a tool yeah. which is sufficient for you to live on this earth sufficient for you to discover what's the purpose of your life which is to submit your will to his will yeah, but that's it, sufficient that's, that's the tool point. here he's yeah. not sufficient to do so no. because my reason tells me that god is in contra is no. a contradiction no no my point is I'm, again I'm very, when, again, we say, when we say when we say when you 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 already just said now Beyond this universe, you cannot understand and comprehend yourself. Yes. Yeah. So that's why we say this, we we use the same analogy. We say beyond this universe, beyond beyond the beyond the creation, God we lies. cannot. We cannot. Well, there is no lie. What's the lie? We don't know. I knew, we I mean, don't God, know. We I are, mean, God presides. Yeah. The yeah. Yeah. Beyond, yeah. And, it's and he is him. above, as as yeah. he described but himself. Is he is above that. the heaven, and as well as well adding to this, he is not mixed with his creation. Okay, so he's not, not mixed, mixed with, with the creation, but he has given me the faculty of reason, and my reason tells me he's a contradiction. So I'm false to reject him. No, so it's your misunderstanding. No, 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 it's your me a faculty. Is your misunderstanding? No, no. Is your That's misunderstanding the makes the contradiction? Your it's misunderstanding makes the contradiction. Okay, maybe you like, can help I will tell me. Tell you can save me from Jahanna. Because I'm, I'm it's asking, called Jahannam. Sorry, Jahannam, Jahannam. Okay, how can God be all powerful? And okay, I cannot can save you, by the way. Okay. I cannot save you. Do you know that? Do you know why? Do you know why? Do you know why? Why can I not? That's why, because I, Allah yeah. told us, yeah. you don't guide whom you love, but Allah guides whom who wishes. No, so, so he is the one who guides you, not me. How can he be all loving if I'm predetermined to go to ask the him? Glory have you asked him? Itself? Have what, you asked him? What monster have you asked? Listen, being if you condemned to eternal destruction and horror, yeah, because you don't want to accept him. That's I, so, I tried to, but I think he's you a ludicrous. No, keep trying. My point is to yeah, you, listen. Is this what you are asking? If, if he has condemned me, I, I just, I, I, by the way, I'm by the way, repugnant. By the way, by the I way, reject have it. Have you, have you, have you read about Jeffrey Lang? No, I have not. Okay. There, he was an atheist and actually he was the head of atheist society in his university. He's, I think, professor in mathematics in, in America. He's a professor, a well-known, well-known figure, by the way, yes. and well-respected figure. And then he himself, he was an atheist. He was a sworn enemy against faith, all faith. Yeah, good man. Yeah, Sounds and like then a man of reason. yeah, and then he, after reading the Quran, after opening his heart to the Quran, he became Muslim. That's amazing thing. Read about him. His name is Jeffrey Lang. Sounds like he looked at too many statistics no. and had a mental breakdown. No, 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 no. Maybe no, his wife no, left him. No, 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 no. He didn't. Like by the way, that's why. But with the, by the way, people like him and others, they are not someone will be will accept the faith just because of emotional impact. He was a person of reasoning, and he said, "This is uh, this is his word." He said, "The Quran. When you read the Quran, you will be in one of the two choices. No, no third. You will say this book, as if you will ignore that it exists or something. Just ignore all the information that's there, and just move on. 
or you have to accept what it is. One of the things. There is no third choice. All of the deep questions. Have you, of have you read the Quran? Have you read I, the Quran? I, I've read bits of the Hadith. No, 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 no. I, no, I don't. No, no. Do you have a Quran? The you have Quran? Muhammad was you have Quran? as vulnerable as a virgin, as a uh, veiled virgin. It's somewhere in the Hadith. I'll find no, it for you. No. Uh, yes, yes, yes. No, it means he was shy. Yeah. That's so yeah, 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 yeah. These yeah, are these yes, are beautiful. Yeah, yeah, these yeah, are beautiful yeah, yeah. descriptions. That That's but, something. He was shy. He was someone who's shy. He will not be like up front. Like this. The Quran is beautiful. It's then, did you read? Did you read? Did you read? I've read the first surah. Okay, the then. First surah. First surah does not have. Do you have a Quran? No, no. Thank you. Have it. I will. I will read devour it. it. But listen, I, listen, listen. I, 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 need, I need two things from you. Listen. Yeah, before, yeah, before yeah. you. But can I, I need. I need. I need two things yes, from you. Yes. I need only two things from you. First thing, I need you to go to read the Quran. Yes. Like, op like literally with open mind and heart. Of just course. open, just see. I've tried what to, is and I read it. I find it absurd. No, read, read it. No, no, no. I tried to divorce my soul. Come on. From the prejudices of oh. my of my education, by the way, why don't you, and I cannot because it's absurd. My way, reason tells me it screams do, to me. Do you work? It is nonsense. By the way, do you work? Do, do you work in any theatre? By the way, no, I do not. <laughs> you should. You should apply. Relax. I, I, come down. Yes, I, yeah. no, no, no. Come down. Is, I, come I, down. Come down. Save your mind. You just said. Listen, 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 listen. You just friend. said now you didn't uh, read the Quran and you said I read it. So you, you could ridicule yourself. I've so my advice to you. Have I read it to the degree an Amman has? No, 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 no. no I have not. But have I gazed across some yeah, of the read, pages? Read. Yes. Read that's not enough. Read it too. So go read, read it. it go and read right. it. So that's the first thing. Okay. The second thing, my advice to you, go Google Jeffrey Lang, study him or know about him. Yes. Read what his story about Islam, and then come back to us next week. Okay, but can next I? Week. I'll see. You one, have a week. I'll say one thing before I leave. Yeah. Okay. You are saying my. You are saying my reason is smothered. It is smothered by ignorance and secular thoughts and mis uh, uh, misapprehensions. But I am purely asking you a question about. The he, he's of good. God. He's good to work in a the theater, actually. You know, he's reason. a good actor. By the way, when you do this, my, uh, my, my reason. By the way, what do you do for a living? I'm, I'm a student. My reason. <laughs> my reason. Are you an actor? No, no, I'm, what, I'm what, a student of philosophy. What? Philosophy? Uh, ah, mind. okay. This is why okay. I think that. The, I that I, makes I, sense. You're the same. Actually, to be actor is better for you, by the way. Uh, so I, I, enjoy, I enjoy walking on the stage I, of the mind. And, and I when enjoy. I come across. The Allah on the stage of the mind, I cannot, fight. I can do nothing. I try to submit to him, try but harder. I have to reject him because he is a rational concept. Try hard, try hard. He's an irrational so concept. Go I'm and sorry. read. These are the two things that I'm, I'm requesting from you. Will you do them? I will, I will read the Quran and I will return to you and ask you some serious questions. No problem. There you go. That's one thing. The second thing. But can just you relax. do something just for relax. me? Wait, just can relax. Please, let me do, can I, off, can I ask you to do something for me? Can you please look at a secular moral structure, a, a moral system I already, I already which was not birthed in Christianity nonsense, or nonsense, Judaism nonsense, nonsense. or yeah, like nonsense. Aristotle or Plato? Because these are they philosophical God believer. systems. They, they, uh, Aristotle which, was God believer. They, they, they form a Aristotle was God believer. Accord, the according to them, by the way, can advance towards flourishing, yeah. beauty, well, harmony. By the way, by the way, and these, and these minds were not. Swayed by Christianity or religion. By the way, by the way, these were wonderful systems now, of thought. By the way, Aristotle that you mentioned, Aristotle that you mentioned, it's a prophet. Is, no, 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 it's not. I don't, I don't see he's a prophet, and I don't say he's even. I don't say he is a believer in God or something. But according to him, he's a God believer. Yeah, he believes he's a God. believer of God. Yeah, of the unmoved mover. Yes, yes. But I, his, yes, I agree with that. His, so, his, so then but the morality that he had. He did what not was it? No, no, no. I can take bits of his philosophy and reject other sections. So up of it. to you. So you See, I'm allowed and to do so that. So You have to accept the entire so, so book. So I do not. So, not, so, so no, my no my advice to you: the two things. Uh -huh. Yeah. So I already. Did my yes, homework, yes. so I I don't need to have to do, to do it again. Uh -huh. Now for you, okay. These are the, your homework. Uh -huh. Read the Quran, study it, open your mind for the Quran. Secondly, read about Jeffrey Lang and see him, see some of his videos because he will explain his story about Islam. That's all. Okay. Are we done? Uh, yes. Uh, are we and done? I, and I, yes. I, I, I hope. Done? And I and I, I. Are you done? I will read the I'm Quran. Done. I will read the Hadith. And maybe I'll, I will understand why okay. the divine descended to okay. yes to talk about. Many things, morality, 
I, I've done this. I've, I've done this. I've done this. And done. the human essence. I've done this. Pleasure to meet. Uh, What's okay. your name? My name is Sheikh Mohammed. Sheikh Mohammed. Yes. A pleasure. Pleasure. Sheikh, she, she, you are one of Imam. 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 Yeah, you're yeah, Imam. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's a pleasure to speak with an Imam. No. A learned scholar. That's good. Thank you. Thank you. Look after yourself. May Allah guide you. I hope he, I hope my reason guides me, and if it is towards Allah, let it be. Good. That's what. Guide you to wear a vest. <laughs> all right. Okay. By the way, this is all of, about after all this madness. Alhamdulillah, we try to represent Islam. And by the way, sometimes we get these hacklers. They come. They try to attack Islam in all ways that they can. And that's why we need to we need to be patient first of all in our da'wah. And we sometimes as well go. Um, you know, we show some maybe uh, a side which we don't want to show it, which is, for example, we are a human being. We have shortcoming. And the thing is, we try our best to, to show Islam in the most peaceful way. But those people, they, they come and they attack Islam. They speak bad about Allah. They speak bad about the Prophet Sallallahu And we, we get angry. We ask Allah to forgive us first of all. And we ask Allah to guide this guy. Hopefully he's, uh, you know, Allah will open his heart and mind to the truth, inshallah. Jazakumullah khair. Subhanakallah, alhamdulillah. Nashadu Allah, 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 n